Hi, this is Matt Wachensky, Senior Director of the Vulnerability Research Team here at Sourcefire. And this is the Vulnerability Report. In this month's report, we'll be going over the latest and greatest Microsoft patches for Patch Tuesday and talking about some of the other interesting things that are currently going on with both Firefox, Oracle, and the Java JRE. This month, Microsoft released six patches covering a number of different CVEs. Out of these six patches, three are interesting. The first one is MS09028, and it contains CVE 2009-1537. And this is for the publicly exploited in the wild exploit against Direct Show that a number of uh, exploit gangs are using to attack clients as they browse to malicious websites. The next one that also falls into this group is MS09032, which is the kill bits for the ActiveX controls for the MS video control. This is also being exploited in the wild. The third one is MS09029, which isn't being exploited in the wild, but is most likely to become a public exploit here very shortly. The three remaining Microsoft vulnerabilities, MS09030, MS09031, and MS09033, are very complicated vulnerabilities and will most likely not result in public exploits. If you don't have a lot of time, patch the other three first. So let's talk for a second about things not Microsoft related. In the last two days, several zero-day exploits have been released against Firefox 3.5. These attack that browser and, and are remote buffer overflows, essentially resulting in remote command execution. These vulnerabilities are really kind of interesting because they were published on Millworm and uh, nobody really had any heads up on these things. So if your users are using this browser out there, they need to be aware that there could potentially be new exploit sites out there attacking these vulnerabilities. And when the patches are ready for these things, hopefully in the next couple days, that they should update their browsers immediately. Additionally, since DEF CON is coming up in the next week and a half, expect additional zero-day vulnerabilities to either be released in the next couple days or directly after DEF CON. If you don't have your people on, uh, on alert for what's going to happen during this conference, you should definitely bring them up to speed as to what DEF CON is and what kind of information will be shared there, as it will probably result in a number of new vulnerabilities coming out directly in the beginning of August. Thank you for taking the time today to hopefully watch the first of many vulnerability reports that we will be giving over the next several years. Um, hopefully I've given you some information about which vulnerabilities to patch, which ones to do first, and some interesting trends that are going on with both Firefox and DEF CON. Uh, I appreciate you watching our video today, and I'll be talking to you guys in the future.